Recently I came across a reggae band on uh, NPR Tiny Desk. And I liked what I heard. Um, good musicianship. Some interesting changes, mostly the usual reggae thing. Kind of rootsy, but uh, I've been looking for it for a while, from back in the day, looking for what's happening with reggae, and I liked it. So I went and bought the album, MP3, download, and, uh, well, I thought, do they think I'm a child? Everything was uh, like candy-coated, banging tune, I don't know, with a kind of sweet sweetener or something. Mm, I prefer the live NPR one. I don't know how they mix it on NPR, actually. It's, it's very good. But a little bit out of tune, not, you know, just just natural. Just, yeah, a little bit of chilli now and then. So I um, began wondering what it would be like to have a, a more neutral, natural sound. Also, I've been reviewing mics, as you may know all with their different shapes and after a while I'm thinking <laughs> where do you go so I found a kind of a a little bit of a longing if you like for purity and naturalness only going to work in some types of music obviously more acoustic stuff probably so the SV33 has a large cardioid pickup pattern and I got to thinking could I use just the SV33? And if it's a simple acoustic thing, pick up everything with the one mic. How more natural can you get than that? I mean, you might say stereo and have two of them, but I'm thinking, yeah, let's just keep it as simple as possible. And I got to thinking further. At the Brit School, there's an acoustic piano, a Yamaha. Just been tuned. Okay, might be nice to have a Fazioli or a Bosendorfer. Or a Steinway. Or a Mencantal Cambia del Color de Tuso Hush. Any one of those. But we've got a Yamaha. And I've got some good singers. And I thought, for an experiment, why don't I set the SV33 up, have the piano here with the lid up, and the singer maybe there, and the mic maybe there, so that someone standing where the mic is would hear a good balance between acoustic voice and acoustic piano. You're going to get the room as well, of course, but I'm after naturalness, so there's some noises. Forgive me. Well, I'll forgive them. Um, yeah. Well, it's never going to be exactly like that. And as a singer, I like to use the proximity and the, 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 the kind of intimacy and the placement, which I'm not going to do now because I haven't got headphones. Uh, you could probably learn to do it without if you knew your equipment very well. So it would be a little bit of a mixture. It would be the kind of acoustic, pure thing. But the singer, maybe, if they were standing, could learn to maybe get a bit closer. I don't know what's happening because I haven't got headphones, but, you know, you just learn how to do that. And maybe then if they are going to be a bit louder, they'd move away. Of course, you're going to get more of the room if you do that. But we're after a kind of natural thing, just with the one mic. No fiddling. Compression, why? Reverb, I quite like. But any of the other stuff, EQ, why? If everything's as it is, why do you want to do all that? So that's what I've been thinking. So this is kind of, was a test for me. I've set up to do that at the Brit School. And I've got the Tascam DR100 Mark III. It's meant to have good mic inputs. I don't understand really all the sampling rates and this and that. I use 48K for because that's what video uses. Uh, but I've got it set on 2.4 something instead of the normal CD thing, because somebody online said, what am I to do? I just have a look at a few suggestions, and if there's a general trend, yeah, might as well go with that. So I, I've, I, I was going to use the uh, lovely, the, S, the, the Tascam and the, the, S, the Earthworks 33, and there's my recording studio. And the art would be in the placement and the singer and the musician 
to learn to balance that. Something you'd have to learn. So I thought I'll do a video and see if this is actually feasible and uh, use my acoustic guitar and me singing and this. And uh, I thought, well, why not test the actual Tascam mics as well? So bear in mind, Tascam mics are stereo and I'm too close, really, because the voice is kind of in the middle there, not really far enough away. Uh, this is mono, which has been converted to stereo and audacity. Well, it's not stereo, is it? Because it's mono, but too, I don't know, whatever. I just did it. Um, not enough room for mic placement. I'd like to play with that a lot, but I'm too restricted here. So this really is just, uh, I thought it might be interesting. I, th I, th I think it's I think it's reasonably revealing. And uh, it was originally for me, but... They call me Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my star. They call me Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. I like the man and even manipulate you. Guaranteed to make you smile. Can you hear me? Can you feel it? Maybe you're broke. Maybe you have wealth. Maybe in demand. Or maybe baby on the shelf. Whatever your situation, there's one thing you should do. Reject all automation. Let me work on you, Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. Uh, I like the manual manipulator. It's guaranteed to make you smile. Yeah, yeah, they call me Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. Yeah, yeah. They call me Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. I like the manual manipulator. Guaranteed to make you smile. Yeah, I like the manual manipulator. You guaranteed to make you manual manipulator. You guaranteed to make you manual manipulator. You guaranteed to, guaranteed to make you smile. They call me Mr. Manual. They call me Mr. Manual. <laughs> they call me Mr. Manual. Manual. Automatic's not my style. They call me Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. I like the man and he manipulates you. He's guaranteed to make you smile. Maybe you're poor, maybe you are well. Maybe in the world, maybe, maybe on the shelf. Whatever your situation, there's one thing you should do. Reject on automation and let me work on you, uh, Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. Uh, uh, uh. I like the manual to manipulate you. It's guaranteed to make you smile. Hey, call me Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. Hey, they call me Mr. Manual. Automatic's not my style. Guaranteed to make you smile. Guaranteed to make you smile.